The end of the 19th century saw huge breakthroughs in physics, which would lead to new medical treatments for many types of cancer. In 1895, German physicist Wilhelm Röntgen discovered X-rays and invented X-ray machines. Other scientists and doctors began experimenting with X-rays and discovered that X-rays damaged biological cells and tissue if they were repeatedly targeted. In 1896, French physicist Henri Becquerel used the work of Röntgen to try to find out where radiation came from. He was the first to work out that radiation came from the chemical element itself. In 1898, Marie and Pierre Curie were carrying out research on X-rays and uranium. The Curies discovered two new elements that emitted much stronger levels of radiation, polonium and radium. Marie claimed that it was the atomic structure of the elements that produced the radiation. She described the process as radioactivity. Eventually, in 1902, Marie Curie managed to isolate radium. As radium was much, much stronger than X-rays, it was soon discovered that it had a much greater impact on biological cells and could be used to destroy or reduce tumors. Radiation therapy, soon called radiotherapy, has been used to treat some types of cancer ever since. The work of Marie Curie and others had a huge and immediate impact on medicine. For the first time, it was possible to successfully treat some types of cancer. Radiotherapy was commonly used as a cancer treatment, with differing degrees of success from the early 1900s. As research continued, radiotherapy became more successful. Curie also proved the value of women scientists to medical research and inspired more women to become scientists, expanding their role in medicine.